Part two. <laughs> Let's get it. So, two videos in one day. <laughs> <laughs> or shooting. I don't know when you're going to see this though. But so this is the BTS to what we released before, right? Yeah. yeah. I'd say a week ago, but who knows when this yeah, is going to exactly. come out. No, so. God knows. <laughs> this guy's a busy guy. <laughs> but no, so all the cinematics that we filmed in the last video, Bash is going to give me a tutorial on how to do it since he's Tips the magician. Tricks. The no, magician. No, no, no. Come on. Remember that? That's your nickname <laughs> yeah. for now. So the magician's going to teach me the ways, basically. Um, basic stuff, really. So any of you guys who want to get into videography, uh, cinematics it doesn't have to be Simple of course things, yeah. yeah exactly it's not, it's not difficult. follow anyone your passion yeah anyone yeah. can do it literally so we're gonna get into probably the simple stuff first so we'll cut to that scene now so for this one is the orbit shot heel toe as you're spinning yeah but you're spinning with your wrist instead it's very hard to explain, explain isn't it yeah, yeah. so yeah yeah like sly you'll be able to tell when your gimbal starts to spin and it's exactly when you keep moving to the left so the next one simple zoom out you start at the level you want and you just pull back toe heel toe heel yeah yeah you the the whole point of that is you're trying to cushion all of them up and down movements the gimbal the only thing the gimbal stabilizes is the three axes this way up and down yeah. and the side to side this way like that oh, I see. yeah it doesn't stabilize this Fine. so if while you're filming it's stable this way but it's not stable this way your video is going to come out fucked that's why i tell you to do the little heel toe the next one bit difficult but i think you can do it like i said before you start the windscreen yeah. you come down when the bmw logo hits the middle of the screen you stop but you keep backing away yeah okay. keep backing away how would you think is a creative way to shoot the mirror cups? Out of the two that I showed you, which one is more appropriate? Oh, like that? Mm, yeah. Uh, I'd say orbit. Orbit, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's what, the one I would go for as well. So start here. Yeah. Just as you're spinning, you see the camera start to move. Yeah. Follow the camera. It's easier once you know what, know you're what doing. to do, innit? Yeah. Yeah, I must look really yeah. awkward doing it. Yeah, but it, you're going to get used to it. Yeah. So you are shooting yeah. at 60 FPS on your phone right now at 4K. Yeah. When you put it into your Premiere Pro sequence, yeah. you put your sequence at 29.97, okay. which is the standard for um, YouTube yeah. in the UK. But when you're, you're when you got 60 FPS footage into a 30 frames per second sequence, you can slow it down by half the speed, right. and there'll be no frame loss. So uh, Premiere Pro doesn't have to create new frames. When you're slowing it down, you'll see it. Now when you're editing, you'll see it. Um, there's a drop down menu that says um, frame blending and there's one called optical flow select optical flow okay. and you'll be all good to go so if I'm filming say on a 30 uh, frames per second yeah. and slowing it down would that have um, it, became, it becomes choppy right. you know it becomes that like a sense. like a helicopter rotor it yeah, becomes yeah. like uh, 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 uh. that's what that is because it doesn't have those frames so on here we're shooting at 120 yeah. so I can slow it down to four times that ah, yeah it <laughs> yeah it looks proper slow yeah. you get what I'm saying you learn something yeah exactly <laughs> that's why boot spoiler the best way to shoot this is if you start at a high angle like this yeah this is just the simple you're just going like that along the bend yeah okay and, come around there and just take a video. go on so you're just starting here and you're coming around the bend like that you see that your, the the thing of shooting cars just follow the curves okay. literally just follow the lines and you should be all good and with this you can do the little like you know the orbit I taught you yeah same orbit just around the corner there you see that mm. nice angles <laughs> see, this is why section 59 is popping up right now yeah <laughs> <laughs> and then another orbit you can do is all the way around like this because the car is small around the back you can do a quick orbit and then when you slow it down yeah. it will look proper smooth uh, okay. let me get you a little bit more another shot yeah for cars especially is the wheel wheel from the side yeah so if you go like here and you just pull out slow so a lot of the movement 
It's basic moves, basic moves. You're just you're just adding a little bit here and there, yeah. Yeah. Um that's cinematics fam. What do you think? I mean, you made it sound way easier than it actually is. But it is easy though, yeah, no? I think, the, I think again, like anything, it's practice makes perfect. Exactly. Right? So, so guys, yeah, hopefully that was useful for you. Um, let's let's do a quick summary. Let's so. do a quick summary. So what was the first thing I learned? So cinematics is all about basic movements. It is. As Bash was saying, it's literally moving in, out, doing the orbital and then as you advance you learn to mix them up so like a simple zoom in so you could go from like what i showed you the wide angle shot to a close-up shot mm -hmm. with the zoom transition and it'll look really nice it's just about how you move between the shots really yeah when it comes to cinematics and a key thing he taught me today is to shoot in the <laughs> highest frames frame as you possibly, can yeah. and then when you slow it down it i don't know if you guys have noticed in some of the other videos i've tried slowing down stuff it and it's buttery, yeah, yeah a little bit, bit choppy, so now i know the clear. reason for it <laughs> So definitely make sure you film in what, 60 p yes? As high, so Six when you're shooting cinematics, as high as possible. Okay. So on my camera, it goes up to 120. On his phone, I know it goes up to 240, but at 1080p. I just say don't do that. Shoot at 60 FPS at 4K and you'll be perfect. Perfect. Yeah. And if, you know, for people who are starting off with cin uh, yeah, cinematics, cinematics <laughs> videography, that kind of thing, yeah. what would be your like first tip? Like, would it be to get, like, for me, I'm starting off with a smartphone gimbal, just get so to grips with it. Start with what you have, yeah. definitely. So what you've done, smartphone gimbal, DJI Osmo, best way to go. Because you can learn, it's not very complex to use. So the setup I have is kind of complicated. Like you, even you're like- oh, Yeah, a little like, bit, yeah. it's heavy it's as a, hell. It's a, big, <laughs> it's a big setup to carry around. So I wouldn't say when you're starting out, don't get that. Do not get this setup, it's not worth it. Yeah. You're gonna be very confused and you're just not gonna enjoy the experience. DJ Osmo, start off with that, learn the basics, then move on to this, get a bigger camera get lenses you'd be perfect man i hope you guys enjoyed that you know i know everyone's kind of getting into this cinematics yeah. now especially in the car scene so <laughs> and <see> you. <laughs> yeah we see you no but if you guys do want professional uh, cinematics yeah. we do magician do, here yeah. section, 59, section 59 we're all here we to do, help we do cater to your needs yeah <laughs> you'll see a few paid videos that are coming out very soon yeah we do we do do that now <laughs> we're moving up in the yeah, world <laughs> but no yeah. Uh, make sure you guys are keeping an eye on this channel Definitely. got a nice little m3 versus yeah. 235 video coming out soon so <laughs> yeah it's gonna be another Definitely. sick video so make sure you guys you know keep tuned keep tuned make sure to subscribe to yaksha's channel hit the bell notification to make sure updated on the new videos of course comment down below if you like this video yeah you should subscribe to section 59 follow him follow on instagram. instagram follow, follow him on instagram, instagram. and we'll see, see you guys, guys next, next time, time. <laughs> hey